Let's take a look at this beautiful picture that was posted to our Arizona's Weather Authority Facebook group. Cricket, this was her view of the sunrise this morning from Waddell, that red orange sun, uh, the smoky skies uh, giving us some pretty sunrises the past few days. So we appreciate you posting that to that group. Looking at a live picture from the town of Gilbert, we've got a few clouds out there, but it's warm and it's humid this morning. In fact, very humid across Arizona. Although valley highs are going to be uh, below 110 this weekend, the higher humidity is going to make it feel just that much hotter, if not close to 110. We will see storms in the mountains later today. Storms are a possibility tomorrow afternoon and evening. That's going to be our best storm chances for the weekend. And then wildfire smoke that's moving in across different wildfires throughout the region into Arizona, prompting a high pollution advisory for Maricopa County today and tomorrow. We're looking at a high today of 106 average is 104 yesterday we're at 100 so a little bit hotter than uh, that nice little treat we had the record though 113 set back in 2011 we will stay away from that amen to that all right, we do have excessive heat watches that were issued by the National Weather Service for next week. They're gearing up for temperatures that could be 110 or greater between Monday and Thursday. So if you're working or playing outside, you're going to be at greater risk for heat related illnesses. So make sure you drink plenty of water and take frequent breaks in the air conditioning. Temperature wise right now, it's 71 in Flagstaff, 92 in Phoenix. We have 77 for both Sholo and Prescott. Lake Havasu City checking in at 90 degrees. Those dew points are high. They are in the 60s for many southern desert communities, the 50s and 40s across northern Arizona. So it is muggy across the entire state, and that's going to be some fuel for thunderstorm development later today. Our satellite and radar picture shows quiet conditions, although we did have a few rogue light showers that moved through the valley early this morning. Those have since dissipated. It should be a pretty decent day to get out to the lake. Uh, lake Pleasant and Bartlett will see highs right around 105. Canyon at 103. We've got some clouds this morning. We'll have more sunshine this afternoon and some breezes of about 10 to 15 miles per hour around the state. Solid storm chances for Flagstaff at 40%, 30 to 50% storm chances in Pine Top, Payson between 20 and 30%, and Sedona right around 30%. Hotter community, Sedona, triple digit heat for uh, central Arizona. We'll have highs in the 80s for Pine Top and Flagstaff, the 90s for Payson. So high pressure is moving towards the Four Corners region through tomorrow. That's going to uh, be a more favorable position to see those storms develop across the rim, the White Mountains, and push towards the valley. Eventually next week, we're going to start to see that high pressure drift towards the east, and that's going to give us slightly drier weather as we work into Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. But looking at today and tomorrow, future cast shows we start to see those storms pop across the Grand Canyon south of Flagstaff at around one o'clock. We'll see those storms intensify for northwestern Arizona and central Arizona through the early evening hours. We're not really seeing those storms track towards the valley during the hours, uh, evening hours today, but Late tonight, early tomorrow morning, we could squeeze out a few showers before those storms really uh, fire off again during the afternoon and evening hours along the rim and across southeastern Arizona. These storms drifting towards the valley tomorrow are going to bring us better chances to see that rain, the gusty winds, the cloud to ground lightning, and maybe even some small hail. We could see some outflows that drift into the valley from those storms that generate new thunderstorm development for Metro Phoenix. So we've got the moisture in place place. We'll have uh, more ingredients in place tomorrow over today. Our high for today in Mesa 105, 105 for Scottsdale. Looks like we'll hit a high of 106 today for Goodyear. 105 in Surprise, 105 for Maricopa. Extended forecast shows uh, we do have a 30% chance of storms tomorrow. The high 109 Monday and Tuesday hotter. In fact, those will be our hottest days of the week at 112. Temperatures are going to remain above 110 or at 110 for the remainder of the week.